All right, it's day two. It's the next day after we've made our custard. Uh, like I said, make sure you put your saran wrap on there. What it does is it helps that film that comes across here and it uh, makes it a lot smoother and cleaner. I'm going to take that off. Yeah, see it sticks to the saran wrap. And that's what we want. We want it to stick to that saran wrap so you don't have it in your actual mix. Now, I think I said in the first video, I'm pretty sure, that this makes more than one and a half quarts. So I've got these jars here, and I'm going to fill them up. Uh, they are each uh, half a quart, so I'm going to need to do it three times and put it in our Cuisinart here. So that's what we're going to do right now. All right, we have the Cuisinart mixing right now. I had to go ahead and start it up before we start pouring in. I poured in just a little bit. I'm going to pour in the rest of it. you got to make sure that you have it going when you start putting your mixture in. It's very important. Right. There's my one and a half quarts. I'm going to let this run. Set a timer now the phone for 18 minutes and in 18 minutes we'll come back and check. I'm going to try this out. I was able to get it uh, for my birthday. Thanks mom again. It's uh, going to keep your ice cream cold. So let's see how that goes. Alright, we've had the Cuisinart going for about 18-19 minutes. Let's uh, see what we got. get as much of this as I can, and then we need to put it into storage containers, which are these little plastic containers I have here with me. This is nice. This is a good consistency for soft serve right now if you wanted to do that. I don't. I like to put it back in the refrigerator, or freezer actually, and uh, get it a little bit thicker. Tastes more like uh, regular ice cream. It's really nice. All right, so after you get it all cleaned up, this is pretty much what you're left with, which is really good. Like I said, right now it's more of a soft serve consistency, but now we're going to transport it to this last little spot besides my mouth. Do some big ones, some small ones. If family comes over, somebody wants to have some. Just a single serving. You don't have to go into this one. Makes it a little bit easier. So do a big one, some small ones. But like I said, I like to stick it back into the freezer and make sure. And it gets nice and solid, and then that's when I think it's at its best consistency. But that's what you're looking for right there. All right, let's do one more, and I'll let you go try. Send me pictures. Let's see. <laughs> 